let's see the part three part three right so of normal and tangent so okay. normal and tangent so let's see the question number three so fifth equation is given y equal to x square minus one into x minus two this is the equation one so put y equal to zero and find the value of x so zero equal to x square minus one into x minus two x square minus one equal to zero so x is equal to plus minus one in the singular manner x is equal to two we are getting two points right three points two comma zero 1 comma 0 and minus 1 comma 0. These are the three points, right? Now differentiate this equation, right? So, so y equal to, please multiply this term. So it will be x cube minus of x minus minus plus 2. This is plus x, right? I have multiplied with this. So x cube and with this minus x and this will be the minus 2x square next will be minus 2x square again we have to multiply here right so minus 2x square and minus minus plus 2 so this will not be right now differentiate dy by dx then you will get dx square minus of 1 plus constant is 0 so it will be minus 4x right so this is the slope you are getting at now put the value of x first right 1 comma 0 so this slope will be 3 x square minus of 1 minus of 4 x you have got right put x is equal to 1 so it will be how much divide by dx it will be 3 minus 1 minus of 4 so it will be 3 minus of 5 minus 2 you are getting at right in the similar manner, put another point also. So for this point, what will be the tangent, equation of tangent? That will be y minus y1 equal to m into x minus x1, right? So point we have taken at 1 comma 0. So put here y minus 0 equal to slope value we have got. That is minus of 2. Minus 2 into x minus 1. So it is y equal to minus of 2x plus of 2. So arrange y plus 2 of x minus 2 equal to 0. Right. Now again, use the slope point that is 2 comma 0. So equation you have got after the differentiation is minus 3x x square minus 4x minus 1. So dy by dx is equal to the x square minus of 4x minus of 1. Now put 3 into 2 square minus of 4 into 2 minus 1. So it is 3 into 4 minus of 8 minus 1. So it is 12 minus 9. So it is equal to 3. So this is the next slope. Now you can find the equation of tangent. Equation of tangent is equal to y minus y1 equal to m into x minus x1 y minus y1 y1 is 0 slope is 3 x minus 2 so it is equal to y equal to 3 of x minus of 6 so it is coming out to be y minus 3x plus of 6 is equal to 0 so this is the second slope equation of tangent right next case we have that is Next third point is minus 1 comma 0. So your slope value will be, what will be the value? Equation is 3x square minus 4x minus 1. Now put here x is equal to minus 1. So it will be 3 into minus 1 whole square minus 4 into minus 1 minus 1. So it is 3. This will be plus minus. So it is 7 minus 1. It is equal to 6. Right. So this is your next slope slope 3 so equation of tangent will become y minus y1 equal to m into x minus x1 so it is y minus 0 equal to 6 into x minus of minus 1 so y equal to 6x plus 6 so this is the next 
equation of tangent. Now see the next term, question number six. So question number six is y equal to two x square minus six x minus four. Right. So first differentiate it, then you will get dy by dx is equal to four x minus of six. Right. So point on the curve v x y differentiating. Right, slope of tangent will be x comma y, right? So since the tangent is parallel to x-axis, tangent is parallel to x-axis, right? So, so you have to differentiate, so it will be equal to 4x is equal to 6. So you can find here x. So x will be equal to 3 by 2, right? So y value we have got as zero. So now put in the first equation. So we will get y equal to two into three by two whole square minus of six into three by two minus of four. So it is two into nine by four minus this will be three. This is nine minus four. Right. So cancel this one. So you will get here two. So it is nine by two. LCM is two, right? So it is nine minus of 18 minus of 8. So it is getting nine. minus 9 minus of 26 by 2. So it is coming out to be how much? It is of minus 17 by 2. So this is your y value, right? Now see the next point. So you have got x as 3 by 2 and y as minus 17 by 2. Right. So this is the required points. We have got it. So you have to find only points, right? So please write it down in six portion. Now look at the eighth one. The equation is x square plus y square equal to 25. So put here x1, y1 value in this equation. So it will be x1 square plus y1 square equal to 25. This is your second equation, right? Now differentiate the first equation. So you will get 2x plus 2y dy by dx is equal to 0. Right, so slope will be, these two and two will get cancelled. So slope will be dy by dx is equal to minus x upon y. So this is the third equation. Or it is also called slope of the tangent. So for tangent. Now put the value. So it will be minus of x1 by y1. Right. So tangent is parallel to the x-axis. Right. So put it equal to 0. So it will be x1 equal to 0. And y1 is also 0. So x1 we are getting as 0. So put this equation in the first equation. In second. This fourth value in this equation. So you will getting as y1 square is equal to 25. So y1 will be coming out to be plus minus of 5. Right. So y1 we have got that is the required points on the curve. So that is 0 comma plus minus of 5. So here x is 0 and y is your plus minus 5. So since the tangent to the given parallel to the y axis now see the second condition. So when it is parallel to y axis, right? So, so that will be the infinity, right? dy by dx is equal to, we have to put equal to 0. So find the x1 value. So x1 square equal to 25. So put here y equal to 0. So x1 will be equal to plus minus of Five. So next point will be equal to plus minus five comma zero. So here x value is plus minus five and y value we are getting as zero. Right. So this is the required point we have obtained. 